My name is Larry Orozco. We're at the Teen Workshop. In 2018, they, the city named the workshop after me. I'm very honored and humbled. Founders Jaime Jaramillo and Ruben Uriart and myself uh, had students that worked outside and inside here. Uh, 1974, this was Jake's Mohawk um, gas station fireball and the city helped us find the location during the gas crisis. But these little gas stations went out of business, so we ended up uh, here. And seven years rent free from Mohawk, and the city bought the, the property eventually. And throughout the years, there's been projects with bicycle repair was the mainstay, screen printing. Uh, we had a little uh, employment office here that we referred students out to part-time, full-time jobs in the community, um, babysitting, housekeeping, helping people move, painting houses, yard work, you name it. The students did it. So throughout the years, you know, the community is involved and we used to get the lost and found bicycles from the police department. You come on a particular day, you see bicycles out in the, the yard here. So. Um, that was good and we were able to get um, bicycles parts wholesale from Wilson Bicycles that liked what we were doing with the kids so we were fortunate to be able to get uh, all the bike parts locally. Which kid doesn't like working on bikes or riding bikes so it was just a natural, natural fit and whether we helped one or hundreds that was the main thing that I, I felt that you know if we could get one student in the right direction, off the street, busily working on something here, whether it was woodworking that we did also, uh, body and fender happened out of here too. A lot of the students were doing body and fender or painting, you know, at ROP, at the different locations. They'd come back here, well, we want to do this, Larry. Okay, well, let's go ahead and try it. We would try whatever, you know, they were involved in, you know, steam cleaning engines, whatever. It means it means a lot. It's got you know my heart my heart's here and it's always been here and just uh, again seeing the community, you know, getting involved and doing different projects and you know what? Uh, the parents they end up having their children come here, grandchildren. It's just a full circle. Um, this is like a, a magnet for the community in a sense.